Welcome back to Demon Souls. Don't know why I talk like that, but fuck it. Uh, yeah, so, um, first things first, bottom right corner. So I did some duping. You will note, I haven't leveled once. I only just booted the game up about five minutes ago. Um, barring the warping. So, what I've done in the meantime is, and I probably shouldn't have probably shouldn't have done exactly this, but as you can see, Bastard Sword and Kite Shield are at plus one. I probably shouldn't have upgraded the Kite Shield because I only had three Shards of Hearthstone, which means I shouldn't have even upgraded the Bastard Sword. I'm a fucking fraud. Ah, my bad. Oh well. So, I'll show the duping glitch when we get back, um, but I'm intending to do this, well, go back to this way and go fight the next boss in Boletaria. Then we'll head back. So, the reason I've duped this amount of souls is it's about. We're just about a thousand under the number. the exact number I need to buy everything from the Dregling Merchant up ahead. So that'll get us the plate armor, the claymore, and pretty much everything of worth 50 cells. So it gives us a little more variety. Um, yeah, no, I haven't leveled. I'm intentionally not doing so. I'm probably not gonna... I mean, yeah, when I beat the boss, I'll use its... Well, its souls to level. But, yeah. I can't exactly make boss weapons or boss spells yet, which kind of sucks. So, yes, I am recording this the day after the first session. Kind of just so... Well, I can get this done. And the intention is clearing out 1-2. And I'll do the start of... Um, I might actually, yeah, do all of... 2-1 Stone Fang Tunnel. Just because that gives me a little more options of like where I can go, what I can collect, and just yeah, it'll, it'll help me in the off hours actually do some work. Because there's a lot of good materials in Stone Fang I can start farming for, and some new weapons I, I can try out. And you know, give a level or two depending on what I get. So yeah, we beat Phalanx. Lizard Friend is back. Let's try not to lock on this time. Now let's lock. Oh, are you kidding me? So, as a reminder, we are human. Is that a Hudson? Alright. Ow, fuck you. Ah, well, I guess consider that like a time-saving convenience. So I would have been able to upgrade the Bastard Sword, but I just didn't want to head back to the Nexus. Oh, shit. That was weird. Oh, yeah. Nexial Binding, I'll get rid of that. That's for the duping. So yeah, we've got the Thief Ring and Ring of Great Strength. Which is how I can wear the helmet. I am probably going to have to ditch the helmet relatively soon. Definitely when we get to Dregling Motion. So I guess that'll kind of balance things out a little. Because we got some heavy shit to pick up. But I deliberately avoided it. Yeah, that's there. But I deliberately avoided it in the first place. Because I kind of needed Stockpile Thomas's Ring. Ring of Herculean String. Now, Merelda's gone, because I managed to somehow beat her yesterday. Um, to my disappointment. Ow, fuck you. Okay, R1, R1. There we go. Come on. Yeah, and I said I wouldn't be two-handing too much. Let's just walk into the R2. It's beautiful. And, as you can see, lots of crescent moon grass. Good shit. Okay, now, here's a fun feature I haven't had to show off yet. So you saw how there was climbing. Well, there's another more tried and true mechanic in this game. Uh, you know, as, you know, but the other Souls games carry over. Oh fuck, I, ha I hate doing the drop. I might... <sighs> That's not the armor, is it? Okay, let's do this as a start, because I don't want to die yet. Here we go. Yep. This is as fast as you can go. There's no sliding. I'm holding circle and holding down. I think I'm holding circle without moving down. See? So this is great. Yeah. So over where that message is, if you are one step away from pure black world tendency, there will be an enemy known as a primeval demon. 
it can't really do anything to you, it doesn't really fight. You can flail around a little and might hit you inadvertently, but it's not trying to. Yep, fucking knew it. So that's, uh, that's a bit of a problem. Okay, there we go. So I'm hoping I don't have to head back to the Nexus. Look up. Oh, fuck. Um, I don't remember what the drop item is. I'm probably going to come back and get that. I don't want to die right now. While we're doing this, let's have a look. So as you can see, my item burden is uh, pretty fucking high. And as a consequence, I have to take the helmet off. Oh, even then, I'm still heavy. Too heavy, so let's do this. Yeah. Well, that's my new look. Uh, do I get it? Maybe. Let's do this. I don't want to risk dying, because that's just a pain. Yeah. I should... Nah, duping the, the Shadow Arch Stone's a little BS. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to drop down. Hope we don't die. Oh, all right. Good. Yeah, it's pretty, a pretty generous walkway, I suppose. What have we got? There we go. So that's kind of what I was talking about. Colorless demon souls are pretty fucking rad. And I really did want to hit a load screen, but too bad. Apparently, we kind of have to. So, colorless demon souls are the demon titanite of this game. Um, petrified dragon bone, titanite scales, etc., etc. It's, uh, for boss weapons. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Meanwhile, the brush would set. So, we couldn't have got this unless we're in pure white, pure black tendency. Um, so, yeah, Morald is meant to gate it. Uh, but as you can see, we did a pretty good job of killing her yesterday. So, brushwood helmet. This old helmet was long ago held by the Boletarian royal family. I don't know why I'm doing this accent. It is excellent for staving off flame. Recently, Bior of the Twin Fangs has been known for wearing it. Its heaviness slightly impedes stamina regeneration. So I should have pointed it out. Fluted armor does the same thing. Heavier armor will impede your stamina regen, like how DS1 does it. I'm pretty sure that's a thing they totally dropped in 2 and 3, um, barring something like the um, Great Shield of Glory in DS3. So yeah, armor won't, um, won't fuck with your stamina outside of the first two games. Meanwhile, this shit is heavy as fuck. Very heavy. In fact, let's have a look. If maybe if we... Yeah, see? We uh, can't even cop that. Because we're going to fat roll really hard. Alright, let's see. Let's do some min-maxing. Nah, I think this is... Yeah, that's going to be superior. Oh, well. That's a bit of a shame. Oh, yeah. Brushwood shield. Oh, that's a heavy motherfucker right here. So, 26 strength. 4 morph and purple flame. It'll say similar things. An age-old large shield owned by the Boletarian royal family for ages. Yeah, fending off flame. Bior has been using it. To be one hell of a badass. So, yeah, this is kind of annoying. Um, I wanted to totally skip this. Oh, six, yeah, so I would have had enough to upgrade. So, yeah, I won't upgrade any more this session until after, depending. Okay. Do we get rid of everything? Let's just make sure. Yep. We can chuck these now. We can... Okay, well, you know what? It's fine, because if I go in and show you, um, I'll have 99. Oh, I've have 99 of Hearthstone. I've got... Well, yeah, you know what? Let's just do this now. I, I don't want to fuck up the duping right away, but uh, we might as well do it. I'll just show you. So, if I go to take. So, when you dupe an item, it makes 1,223. Huh, I thought it made 24. Oh, well. Um, if you use an item, in this case, the hard stone, it'll go down to 99. So, that's a thing. We are indebted to you. Ah, oh, cheers, man. So, guess I'll show off how to do it. I won't do the archstone, the shard of archstone. That's a little, that's a little cheesy, I think. Plus, it'll force me to get evacuate, which I could hypothetically get. Look, like, let's just go here for a sec. So, I'll do it for the sake of buying equipment, 
for stuff like this, nah, I'll I'll actually earn it. I I think that's fair enough. Um, so if I fuck this up, um, I have to make a cut and dupe all these souls. So boy, that'll be fun. So here's how you do. Did you? You talk to Baldwin. You go to the Crescent Moon gra Grass under buy items. You hover over OK. You walk away. Now, to my knowledge, you don't have to have the Nexial Binding selected when you walk away. You can cycle through to it. But, as a rule of thumb, have it prepared. Now, you hit square, and instead of hitting yes or no, you hit start. In this case, options on the on the PS4 controller. You talk to Thomas. And then, you deposit the item you wish to dupe. Um, as I don't want to dupe anything. Ah, fine, we'll dupe this. I didn't really want to, but fuck it, I need to dupe something. Alright, so, we're going to hit X to accept. And then we, we are going to mass circle to back the hell out as fast as we can. So, you say yes. Because the animation will play. Like that. So now, if we go in... Sorry, Thomas, I totally disregarded what you said, but you're a cool guy. Thanks. Okay, let's have a look. Take item. Yeah, okay, no, it is 23. I totally forgot. So, I'll do a similar thing with the boss weapons uh, when I finally get around to getting... Yeah. I have to beat the second boss of Stonefang Tunnel to even consider making boss weapons. So, yeah. Wait, where are you going? Oh, sorry, Thomas. Um, so I'll do a similar thing where, that? honestly, given I had if one, something could be done. Uh, he's talking about the main. If um, I'm pretty sure I can't even upgrade a single boss weapon with a single soul, so I'll make a point of not upgrading at all until I can acquire a second. Unless I'm wrong, in which case I'll upgrade one. But I don't know which boss weapons I'd even consider using. If anything, I'll probably. I'm obviously going to be duping the boss spells, like I said. I will duping to make them. Well, that was a really quick load, actually. Huh, weird. Anyway. Yeah, um, I'm going to dupe to make the boss souls. I'm going to dupe the boss souls to make everything... If, if the fucking... I'm going to dupe the boss souls to make everything they can make. Just for convenience, because yeah, I'd like to show off everything this game offers. For the most part, within reason. So yeah, now we can two-shot these guys. That's pretty rad. Sorry, what am I saying? One shot. When you hit them directly. Mm, so maybe I was a bastard to upgrade the bastard sword. Now I could just run, but we might as well. I need to get to 1,000... Oh, what am I saying? 14,900 souls to buy everything I want from the Dregling Merchant. So, um, boy, I hope I hit that number. If not, well, I'll just use a soul. Lever? Lever. Oh yeah, that's right. What am I doing? Recommend the lever. I'm gonna ignore you two, cause fuck off. Boy, I hope I don't die, cause that'll be lame. So just as a precaution. Um, delicious. Dragon is gonna be a dick. We'll leave Herculean strength on. Now we run. Fast. Now, picking up this item like I'm doing is a terrible idea because that gives him a chance to catch up. So we gotta run really fucking fast. Holy shit. Ow. So that's why you don't do that. We'll, uh, we'll get that later. Whoa. Oh boy. Oh, oh fuck you, buddy. So in case you're wondering, yeah, you can kill him. It's not worth it. He gives you a boss soul that you can only use. Um, you can't make anything with it. It's worth 10,000, so it's pretty handy. And also, you know, you get the benefit of he just fucks off. But Red Dragon doesn't appear outside of this world and 1-1. One, one. So. Okay, so you can drop the Guillotine Axe and the Great Axe. Not for Crescent. Only the Fat Fish can do that. Or I'll have to buy it. Prison Axe is pretty cool. 
Um, I probably just prefer the great axe anyway, though. Wooden catalyst? Oh. Yeah, oh, fuck you. So, if I had been prepared, what I maybe should have done was, um, buy a single spell, and then I could use it with the catalyst. If, I'd probably buy cloak or water veil or something. I don't think demon's prank is worth it. You done? No, he's uh, gonna keep going. So we can try to run. Uh, guess what? Shit idea. So we... I don't know why I said that so weird. We are gonna head down. Now there's two ways. Left leads us back to the start where Ostrava was held captive. Let's go this way first. Because once we save Ostrava, he's gonna start walking. Um, I don't want that to happen. You eat shit. Yeah, you get good. Because up ahead, you might be able to hear those sounds. It's not him. He's not the one to worry about. Alrighty. Damn straight it is. Wait, what am I doing? So you... Yeah, you can probably see that. As I was saying, the Elgato for some reason is darker. I don't know why. So let's just have a look. If I stand there... You can probably ma just make that out. So, dogs. They're quite similar to the Bloodborne dogs. Because, as you can see, they've got those... I don't know if you can see, actually. Let's just have a look. I think you can make that out in the Elgato. They've got weird, like, metal tusk things strapped to their face. You can kind of see them on the ragdoll. It's kind of hard. Jesus Christ, you're, uh, you're going nuts. Yeah, um, I think you can kind of make it out. Ah, oh, fuck it. Yeah. Yeah, so this is why it's a problem. Because there's, uh, five of them. So if I had to just run in, I would have potentially gotten fucking murdered. Really badly. Now, unlike Dark Souls 3 dogs, they don't have instant transmission and they can't clip through walls. So, um, you know, that's good. That's great. I, I like it when enemies can't just phase through existence. Through, you know. They can phase in and out of existence at will. That's kind of lame. Yeah, fuck you too, buddy. Oh. Huh. Item behind him. Hmm. Alright, Drickling Merchant. What's up, man? So, yeah, as you can see, I got a lot of lead demons cells. And yep, we are back to the good old only using one at a time. Ah, we meet again. Fancy that. I love Hope you, you too. something that suits you. You're such a bro. Alright. Maybe this was a fucking awful idea. Oh well. Whatever. Okay. So, longsword. We've already got club. Yep. We'll buy that. We can get one in um the second level of stone thing, but we're buying one now. Short spear. You have to buy or you can only get as a soldier. Um, these shields we've all got. Broadsword. This is the thing we really want. Plate. 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 There we go. Thank. Hmm. Actually, let's let's try talk. Hello. So you'll notice we can't. Um... end of great oh, wait. But hell, at least the demons. Okay, it's the same thing. Hard times, eh? I'm sure you'll turn things around. <laughs> So yeah, as you can see, we can't sell. So that's, uh, that's a little different in this game. Let's see. What were we at? So Claymore requires 20. We're only at 18. Now, I don't think I've really tried the Claymore. So let's see. I can still fast roll with it. Let's, uh, let's test out the moveset. It's pretty much what you know and love from Dark Souls 1. Okay, no, it doesn't have the poke bow. It has an overhead. Huh. Well, it is more of a strength weapon, as you can see. Oh. As you can see, no dex requirement, only strength. Okay, is that just a chop? Alright. So, scratch that. It's not the DS1 Claymore. It doesn't have a poke. Broadsword, on the other hand. One, two, three, four. Pretty standard. Blasphemous, isn't it? The broadsword has a poke. How fucking dare they, am I right? Now, I know I'm not doing the rolling attacks, but, yeah. So you start off with side to side, it's for heavies. Let's, uh, let's just do rolling. Yep. Let's do two-handed rolling. 
Yes, it's a secret way moveset video. One set. Oh, oh, rolling one handed. Rolling two handed. Right, so. While we're at it. A club. One, two, three, four. Pretty standard club kind of moveset. Overhead. Yeah. One, two. Alright, let's try heavy again. I forget. So there's that into that into that. I like that. That's a cool one. So let's see. Um, I'll check the spear in one second. Let's just have a look. 88, 109. Huh. So the club could have been better than the Bastard Sword if I hadn't have upgraded. Huh. Neat. Alright, short spear. And then we're just about done. I'll uh, shove the plate armor in a bit. You got your pokes. Pretty normal stuff. I don't know why I did that. Holy shit. I'm not even tired. I'm just... I don't know. I'm in a weird place, I guess. Well, I'm in Volataria, so that's kind of weird. So, yeah, this. Um, when I was testing out Soldier the other night, I noticed you have this, and it goes into this. So it might have been a little dark, so I'll do that one more time. You have your leap into this, now, I haven't really used spears too much in this game, um, or at least when I tried them out one, on one character, I, uh, I didn't really pay attention, so I don't know if that heavy, that second heavy is actually two hits or not. Okay, so we'll pop all this on, fucking fashion show, and all that is almost over. Okay, let's just check one thing though, so I know. Okay, Arden Burden's not too bad. I can probably swap rings, but fuck it. So yeah, I'm heavy as fuck right now. Let's uh, let's run out to the sun so I can show this off properly. Man, that probably would have been better. Running outside, in up into the sun to show you all this shit. Oh. So yeah, plate set. We look like the soldiers, pretty much. Dragon's butt mad. Oh well. So for the meantime, for fairness, let's stick with what we got. I'll use that in the future, but for this episode, nah. I'm also, as I said last time, I'm more so buying it just so I can have it. Ah, uh, because I'm not going to have access to it for a bit. Oh, hey, dude. Fuck you. Yeah, so, to reiterate uh, what I was saying yesterday, once we beat the boss of this world, the Tower Knight, also, yeah, there's a few of these guys, they're not very good shots. Okay, no, no, the back two are. Front to up. I rescind that uh, comment. I retract that statement. Um, what do we beat Tower Knight? Well, our Drinkling Merchant will go to the next level. However, we can't get to the next level until we beat an Archdemon. The big boss of one of the other Archstones. Now, I kind of alluded to it yesterday. Volatari is weird and different because every level except it has... Well, every world has three levels except for it. Volatari gets a fourth because it's the most special. So, yeah. There you go. Hey, Strava. What's Thank up, man? You. That makes twice. Thanks to you, I can now forge ahead. This is a token of my gratitude. Please accept it. Ah, that's the good shit. Sorry, just had a sip of water and a bit of a cough. That is a good shit indeed. Let's have a look at Darkman Grass. Now, he can't get himself into any trouble, so we don't need to run ahead. So, as, as you could see, this thing is fucking rad. A medicinal herb, or herb, named for the lunar phase, completely restores the user's HP and fully heals status ailments. The effect of moon herbs changes according to the condition they're in. Dark moon herbs are rare. Midnight blossoms that are said to be de derived from new moon herbs. So yeah. Pretty fucking rad. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a relatively finite amount. I think you can farm them in some capacity. Where the fuck does Strava go? Holy shit. It's no way you walk that fast, is it? Oh, no, he's, he's a he's a fast walker. He probably couldn't outrun Mr. X, though. That's the only problem. 
Wait, where the fuck are you going? Oh, hold on. Let's drive. What are you doing, man? This is bad. Not a single person left. Why on earth? How did all of this happen? Father! Hmm. Weird, isn't it? Well, you're a fucking liar. I know that much, but I wanted to humor it. All right. So we're back on the first tower. Um, Ostrava, where the fuck are you going? I didn't know he came up here, so let's uh, let's just have a look. The dragon can't fuck him up, which is nice. Okay, that's good to know. What do you what do you do from here? Ah, yep. Yep. And then he'll just loop, I guess. Okay, well, uh, that's good to know. Oh. I was gonna say, like, I'm, I know the majority of, I, I, like, I know most things in this game, but maybe I only have, you know, an approximate knowledge of most things. To quote that weird cat thing from Adventure Time. Fuck that's old, but still. Alright, well, here we go. Ah, uh, we should go back and raid it. Yes, thank you, man. Thank you, brave sir, or madame, whichever. How the fuck do you die? Dogs, that'd be my guess. Could be wrong, however, but I feel that could be the dogs. Now, I'm pretty sure there'll be another soldier just about... Okay, there's not. There's a bunch there. Waiting for us. Well, some of them got wrecked. I think that was the, um, the dragons on the bridge. Hey, buddy. Good shit. Ah, yes. The compound bow. Compound short, um, bow's pretty alright. The compound long bow is better in just about every way, though. So, bow's in this game. So this is effectively the composite bow. From Dark Souls. So, yeah. Pretty standard. I won't, uh, won't use him yet, though. Yeah. I'm probably not going to bother upgrading a bow until I can get my hands on the compound longbow in uh, Shrine of Storms, first part. Which isn't too hard to get. It's just I'm limiting myself as to how, how far I'll actually go. Because I'm, you know, keeping it to which sessions I'm doing. So this dragon's a real dick at this part of the bridge in particular. So what you want to do is this. So we fucked up the dragons back there. So what we're going to do is bait him. So let's have a look. We will now roast this part of the bridge. We will now get roasted by the dragling because he's a shit. So we'll let him come around one more time. Ah, fuck it, that'll be good enough. So you can tell the way he's going based on how he comes in. So as you can see, he flew right over us. Sick. Um, there is a bunch of good shit there. I don't think I have enough time, so we're going to cow it out for a sec. Where is he? Oh, fuck. There's the spike shield and some other cool stuff. Nothing super worthwhile, but we might as well try to get it. Alright, cool. We have time. Let's go. So, there's something from a dead trickling. Oh, it's a corpse. Okay, no, 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 no. That ain't going to work. Shit, shit, shit. Ah, uh, this is really lame. I apologize. I wish this would be a little faster, but alas. Okay, now we can go, I'm pretty sure. Because he's already coming back when he approached to that side. Apparently not. <laughs> Fucking dragon, man. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, Trogdor up in here. It was a dragon man, perhaps. Oh, fuck. Oh, well, we're here, so let's get the items. We might be fucking dead, but who cares? Fuck yeah. We can probably outpace him. Thank you, message. Cool. Have a, have a like. We'll eat some grass. 
and then we'll gun it. So you got to be careful because his little uh, little claws will get you. His talons. Don't ask me how this thing doesn't burn down. Ah, oh, because he, he doesn't actually hit it, of course. Uh -oh. I want to have you on. I'm not even going to need it, but like it'll balance out the fact I don't actually need a second ring right now. Ephemeral ice? Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, shoot. So there's a blue-eyed knight. There's a second one behind him. I think, I don't know if it's this one or the one behind him that always drops in Ed's grindstone. All right, you ready? Come here, fucker. Yeah? What you got? What you got? Spacing. Oh, or not. You just gotta be careful because you don't actually have a lot of room to fight him. Due to the dragon being a dick. No, okay, it's the next one that'll always give you an edge grindstone the first time you merc it. All right, let's try two-hand it. Let's just see. Ow. Good hustle, man. Ooh, good roll catch. Good roll catch, man. Yeah? Um, so he's using the Night Shield as opposed to our little Kite Shield. Night Shield is pretty fucking sick. We unfortunately will not be able to get it until the next world. Which we can't even get to, like I said. We've got to uh, wait it out. Thankfully, it's only 32 minutes and we're at the first boss. I will find true love, I suppose. Yes. So, this door, locked. Fantastic. We need to go to 1-3 to get in there. Which, uh, which is kind of annoying. Alright. What are you talking about? Wait, why can't I recommend it? Okay, there we go. That was... That's weird. I must have been missing it. Okay, so there is a crystal lizard right up ahead. So we have got to run. Or we'll give it an overhead. No, you fucking don't. You can see it does that little taunt animation. Let's watch it. Okay, you know what? No. I didn't want to give it a chance. So large... Shard of sharp stone. So that's cool. I mean, we've already maxed out because I duped, but I haven't used it or anything. So those two are apparently quite content to just ignore me, so that's fine. Uh, yeah, this is the fast way down. You don't take a lot of full damage in this game, which is actually, you know, pretty cool. Yeah. Dark Souls 1 and Demon Souls. At Bloodborne, very generous with full damage. Well, in regards to what you can survive. DS2, well, you <laughs> I like that. You get a like, man. You get a like. DS2, yeah. DS2's got some fucky ball damage. Dark Souls 3, also kind of weird in full damage department. Not as bad as 2, by a long shot. Now, that was 2, we'd be dead. Hell, if that was Dark Souls 3, we would have almost died. I can assert I, I can assert that because I can easily back up that claim. I'll get evidence if I need to, damn it. Actually, what am I saying? Just go fucking fall off fire link. Just drop it just drop from the center and you'll you know, soon find out. Okay. Here we go. The tower knight. What a badass. So last part, or rather in part Yeah, in part four. Also, yeah, we got the fat minister over here. Yeah, they're meant to harken back to... Well, the evangelists are meant to harken back to them. So, I made a joke about the one reborn. Also, this music is amazing. So, it's a little different to the one reborn, but still. Um, so, we gotta run. He can't really hit you through walls most of the time, which is great. Have a like. That's solid, man. That's solid. So, Tower Knight is similar to One Reborn in Bloodborne. Alpha. So, all around the arena, you have the Sniper Guys. It's a big trap, orchestrated by the Fat Minister. We'll get to fight one in 2 1 in maybe about 15 minutes, depending on what happens in between. Um, 
But yeah, like even the arena is quite similar. I'm pretty sure it's, yeah, it's almost identical. It's just you don't have this part connects in the One Reborn arena. You don't have this extra upper little bridge, but yeah, basically. And if that was Dark Souls 3, I'd be getting hit by that. What are you talking about? We got all the time in the world. Have a like. Okay. So we are just gonna R2. Uh, if I can hit. And not miss like an idiot. Ah, the duck avoided it. Sick. R2. We should have two more. This guy. Well, you? You're loading fast. I'm impressed. Yeah, he ever is, but... I've never sniped Tower Knight. I don't know if it's worth it. Yeah. Give me a sec. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, uh, well he's... This genius has sorted himself out amazingly. So now we've removed the threat of all that offer. Oh, that was lucky. I, I should have got hit by that, personally, I think. Me personally? Okay. I know I say okay in phrases like that all of the time, but yeah. His shield slam and that wave will hurt a lot. So. Hey, Achilles. Also, yeah, his jumps hurt a fuck ton too. So you want to be careful, because yeah, he will slam you pretty hard. So I guess what, I guess this might have been what the guy meant about the boss's river. So you want to slap away at his feet till you get that effect coming out. Um, and then we can top of the t topple the tower knight. Oh, 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 oh. Rhyming to a degree. Well, we're not getting lucky here. I'm fucking this up. Yeah? Ow, oh, fuck you. So he can fall on you and it'll hurt. So uh, just a warning. What a warning. Okay, maybe I have to hit the other foot a little more. No, that can't be right. Look at it. So yeah, this is also similar to One Reborn, where you want, like, One Reborn you can do more damage to, but you want to stagger him to get the head, like so. It kind of reminds me of the Veronique Knights, or Veronique Knights from Dark Souls 1. Yeah, so we have a little more damage to deal to him than fight is out. Ah, fuck, that could have been bad. Ow! Fuck you, Tower Knight. Yeah, these games have always had amazing cameras on them. You just gotta slap the feet a few more time. Time, sis, sis, sis. Plural, not singular. Alright, come on. Fall. Take the fall. You see, Tower Knight's a heal, but he's trying to become a face. Um, so he's not taking it well that he's meant to lose this. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, this is actually going quite bad. We gotta get the fuck out of here. That was bizarre. Don't ask me why I took that much to fell him again. Alright, Tower Knight. Fuck you. How dare you put up a fight? Whoa. You shall obtain the demon's soul and the power beyond all imagination. Yeah, no. You get fucked. <laughs> Not that shit. I mean, yeah. I'm liking you anyway, just cause. Radio. So we will gain the Iron Demon's soul. Which can make warding, which is a pretty fucking red spell.